Three, two, one. one. You go in. Here we are, fishing friends. We're down at Mountbatten. We're just next to the pub. We're just waiting for Kev to arrive. So tonight we're going out on the kids' night. It was cancelled because of the weather. We've had all this bad weather and finally it's happening. So we've got some lovely little kids out tonight on the boat. We're going to catch them some eels and some hus or whatever's out there, I don't care. And uh, hopefully we're going to catch some fish. This is my whopper stopper, right? And I've had eels up to 20 pound on that, believe me. Right, so one of the kids is going to have a bit of fun on that later. Just have a pan around there, mate. Beautiful, look, Plymouth, yeah. absolutely beautiful. You need to get down here. The sun's out, look. What more you know, could you want? Everybody's out having a beer. You know, summer's on the way. Let's do this, man. friends we're out on crusader on the kids night it's been cancelled because of the weather the weather's been crap the weather's finally lovely it's flat calm we've got kids on the boat we've got john locker from the fish locker we've got the bass man everything's gonna go well let's go and say hello to the kids yeah oh by the way i'm doing the rigs tonight the rigs are on me bass man's bounty rigs that's actually the downtime rig there that actually you developed kev so that's your rig but it's my rig if you know what i mean and uh, Matt from Southwest Sea Bait's been very kind and given loads of baits. We've got all the best fresh bait. So yeah, we're good to go. So we're just going to say hello to the kids, shall we? So yeah, here we are. Kids are on the boat. Oh, name call. What's your names? Billy. Alfie. Nathan. So we've got Addy. Billy. Billy. Alfie. Alfie. Nathan. Nathan. And we've got John Lucker at the back. We've got a couple of dads on the boat. Hey, Jeff, Nick, Jeff, Nick, Ryan, Ryan Ross, Ross. <laughs> so we're all going to go out. We're going to catch a load of fish, and we're going to put some smiles on these faces. Let's do it, man! Yeah! Woo! Let's, Let's do it. Now yeah, we're all famous now. Look. Chocks away, Kev. So we're going to bait it up for me? <laughs> That's a big pop up. This <laughs> <laughs> man's done that self pop up. Yeah. You can't feel the ledge because it slides up and down. So if there's a fish that you can feel the ledge, you'll tell me you're making it into the sand or the dropping. This has got the sliding lead on it. Now this piece here is called your hook length because it's your length with your hook on. I said it was all simple, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> did you get did you get all that? <laughs> are you listening? Yeah. Good lads. Yeah, so here we are. John's just explaining the uh, my rigs to these guys. It's a uh, my downtime rig, it's a bit of a bolt rig. Yeah. Go yeah. on, John. Carp anglers will know that just as a bolt rig. It's a self-hooking rig. Being that you've got a locked in piece here with your slider on. So that if you've got a shy biting fish. It doesn't feel any resistance of the lead and as it draws through eventually it will hit and hook itself nice but at the same time now when you're fishing like we are here we're going braid straight to your swivel it gives you a little bit of stronger line so you're able to lift the fish up with your hook lengths here you can change the the strength of mono depending on what you're fishing for if you're fishing for things like rays like hush you can get away with 50 60 pound line if you're going to go up to conger eels you might want to go a little bit heavier See how we get on, John, eh? That's 80 on there. What's that, a 6 or an 8 That's a Tamar 6 or wide. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right, you're rolling, Paul. Right, here we go, look. So there you go, I've just brought on a pack of wraps tonight there. What's that? I haven't got my glasses on. It says squid and bluey wraps. Squid and, I, did, I did know what it was. <laughs> squid and bluey wraps, there you go, look. What's a bluey? Simplicity itself. Like right. a garbage. Let's have a hook. Somebody's hooked. Anybody's hooked. Oh, Coming in on that, Kev. So there you go, look. Bluey on one side, squid on the other. Obviously that's the head end, and it's just literally 
in and out like that. Close up of that. It's really technical stuff, this. <laughs> and then that's it, look, just wrap it up. That's a convenience bait, already done. No messing about. And then I'll just finish it off with the old double looper. Triple looper, in fact. Gather that up nice and gently. And there we have one little, nice little hush snack there, look. So yeah, we're gonna get the, get, get the baits down, get some stink in the water and uh, catch some fish. Make sure you set your bait up. The main thing is when you're making a bait, is that the hook is sticking right out. Because if the hook's hidden, if a fish comes and puts it in its mouth, it's never gonna get hooked. Because this piece here, it catches you the fish. Got that? <laughs> now you're led, this little clip here, like a shorty brother. Open it up, clip your lead on. Now the important thing is, is to make sure it clips back up again. Because if it's not, if it's open, as soon as your lead hits the bottom, it's going to fall off. off. So clip it up, then we're ready to go. Good luck, mate. Get your brother to move down a little bit. Pull this to the hot seat. This is where it's going to catch all the fish. Right, just like the show to your brother, if you want to come here, just swing it under your arm. You know what I said about keeping your thumb on the spoon? If you don't put your thumb on there, when you let go of it, what happens? It just runs off real fast, doesn't it? So if you want to take this arm up, put it over the top, keep tight hold of it. I'll loosen this off. I will. Excited? Just let me slide this in, you've got a line on the end. Ah. Now we're ready. Cooking with gas. So pull this back. Line slide out. The reason you keep your thumb on is because when it hits the seabed, if you don't keep your thumb on it, it just keep running, won't it? You just gently, gently hold on. You're going to tell me when it's got there. Click this back up. We're ready to go. That's it, you're fishing. What we might do with you, because this is quite a heavy rod, just let go for a second. We'll give you a little bit of extra line. And we're going to put this in here. And what you'll do, just keep your hand on it here like this. Because if a big fish picks it up, it'll pull it. Okay, you're going to look for it. Ready? So here we are, all the baits are down now. We've had one little drama. And you've, you've had a rattle, haven't you? It'd be the magnificent whiting or a pout, a big pout. Still rattling. It's quite a big bait on it and a big hook. That's what it's all about, getting the kids out on the rods. And the dads. Make you famous. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, Millie. All them lads at school will be saying, I've seen you on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah he's got a white red light. And there's me, there was me, I feel <laughs> bad <laughs> now. Because I said to her, I said, don't go, just go and get changed. You don't need to be doing your makeup and going fishing on it. <laughs> and now she's going on YouTube. <laughs> Had a few little knocks on you. So here's Addy on the end of the boat. How you doing, Addy? Look at me. <laughs> Bless. Yeah, so we're at anchor now. We're at a little secret spot. Close put us on. All the kids are down, and a couple of the parents are down as well. And it's just really nice, like, you know, just to get the kids out. And they don't know what to expect because they haven't been fishing like this before. And the two young lads here in the corner, they're like, you know, really buzzing. And, and you've got the young girl at the back, Addy, you know, she's a keen angler there at the back. And you've got Millie here, and she's, she's just getting a bite there, look. And it's just, it's just really nice. Do you know what I mean? This is what it's all about. I mean, it's like, John's come up from Cornwall tonight, John Lockery's come up, you know, and he's given his time for free tonight, you know, me and Kev as well. And this is what it's all about. This is what, you know, we've been waiting for the weather and it hasn't come. And now it's here, and any minute now it's going to go off, isn't it, mate? 
Oh, well, fingers crossed, mate. Yeah. See some congas, see some so, Hopefully, we're going to get them on some fish, and you know they're going to want to take the sport up and carry on doing it. So yeah, I'm actually buzzing. And, yeah, not, nice one, John, for coming up. What's happening, man? Have you got one? Yeah, I think so. Nice. Oh, you've been packing all your bits away, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> it's going really well there. Go on, mate, keep going. Oh, he's gone! Alright, stop whining. That's a doggy! That's a little doggy, you got it, John? That's so good! Oh, oh, oh came oh, off! No fish! That's a good one! <laughs> well done, though, Alfie! Well done, Alfie! Well done, Alfie! Almost! You did really well there. <laughs> And because I had my hand on it, it would count as a caught fish. Yeah. All right, you did everything right there, just took time to come off. Yeah. So you know what you're looking for, you know the bites, you know how to strike, ready to go. No bait, still good bait. Yes! Dad! Oh, yeah. Let's go on, mate. It's all right, we can do this, we can do this together, can't we? Yeah. <laughs> The conga. Go on, turn this way. Turn it around that way. Swap your hands around. That's it. This is the way we used to do it. Go on. Come on. It's all right. It's all right. It's going. It's good fish, mate. Oh, hang on. Rod's falling apart. There you go. You're out the bottom. No, he's nearly up, mate. Short lift like that, and then wind down. So if you bring this hand higher up, this will be bigger than the dogfish. Lift. And then wind down. It's late and all as well, is he? Yeah. yeah, it's a nice fish. Is it? There's the conger coming up. Oh! <laughs> oh! Look here, Layton. Go on, 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 Layton. We are first conger coming in. Look, it's a nice fish, too. Well done, got it. And you lift. Get on! Get on! Yes! <laughs> Go on, Layton. Go on, Layton. Go on. Right, lift up. Come on, Layton. You all get a picture of that one, Dad. Go on, Layton. Calm down. Layton's here, he's coming up. He's excited, but calm down. I'll be right on that side. Here it comes, here it comes. Oh, he's got a hush, hasn't he? Oh, it's a nice hush. Stop, 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 stop. He's got a hush. Oh, Layton, it's a nice hush, man. He's got a hush. Oh, you got the real Yes! Yeah, see the Can we put some lights on, Kevin, in a minute? Just Out here. The door, if you can reach yep. it. Just mind the language. <laughs> no language. Let's have a look, mate. Oh, yes, mate. <laughs> That's nice, a nice double figure conga there. Yes, very good, mate. Good fight, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, I enjoyed that. And your special reel? Oh, yeah, I know, I, I love them upside down. That's yeah. the best way to do them. That's, a, that's the Mitchell upside yeah. down reel. That's a nice black one. That's right. bigger than you, Layton. All right, you're going to avoid the pointy end. Grab that really tight. Go on. All right, you got him? Go on, Layton. Now, you want to put your hand underneath and grab that fin there as well. Grab it tight. All right, and then, and then Bass Man will get a nice big photo, so give him a grin. Wait till he straightens out a minute, mate. Oh, look, there's two photos in the background. Give him the hook. Do less damage. Oh, wow. That's a couple, Hang on, he's straightening out now, mate. Here we go, it's the first hustle of the night. Kev just put this one back. Nice sort of, what, £7, Kev? Yeah, £7. £7. Pound look, Nathan. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. She's ready. Look at that. Go on. Straight down, catch and release. Layton, well done. You, you pleased? Yeah. Yeah? Have you got another one now? Yeah. A bigger one? Right, here you go. £7. Well done. Yeah, so here we are. So, the girl at the back. Is Millie? Is it Millie? I'm rubbish with names. So the girl at the back, bless her, she's just snapped a rod. So I don't know what happened, but she's quite upset. She just sat at the back on the railings and she hasn't got a rod. So uh, obviously I've got a tackle shop and uh, I brought this one along. It's a yeah, Kita Pro. 
Pro Boat 12, 12 pound class. Really nice rod. I put it on here for a bit of a demo rod, didn't I? Yeah, we used back. it. Used it a couple of times. Yes. A lot of people right. impressed. Come in and buy them. And yeah, you know, just a quick. I will do a little bit to the camera there. Look, so it's a lovely, lovely bit of kit. All right. Obviously, it's not brand new. It's had a bit of use now, but I'm just going to go and give it to an else. Come on. Good luck. I'll give you this. I'll go and get my head like that. If it starts pulling like it's going to pull the rod over the side, start right with it. Feel a bite, did you? I can't feel it. You will in a minute. Oh, is that a bite? Small one now, Nick. No. <laughs> Striking into a fish, hold up to the reel like that. You have to really, really pull out. Congress and Hooks have got a really hard head. You need to get that little hook into its mouth. So if you can hold it, you watch it. you're waiting for like a, like a big bite. As hard as you can. You have got a fish down there playing with it. Could be a little dogfish, could be a monster hungry, you never know. You just want to down the bottom. Just like, feel that bang, feel that bang there. Yeah. That's the leg, keep the leg on the bottom. There we go. Oh, that was you. Was it? That was a John bite. Oh, he got me excited there, John. When you strike, you have to. Like that. He's on, isn't it? Right, there you go. Go on, Billy, bring it in. Right, get on, Bill. Yeah, on. Go, go on, Bill. Bill. Lift up. Oh. And then wind down. So wind, 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 wind. Now lift. Do you wind under the No. no. <laughs> what you need to do, though, is you need to make sure that the rod always stays bent. I know, go to one. That's what I said to you. That, that was perfect, that. That's it. So lift, no, now wind. Pump and wind. Gently, gently. Now start winding. That's perfect. Just keep doing it like that. Lift and then wind down. Oh, it's still there, look, see? Billy. Don't stop. Keep going all the way to the surface. Go on, Billy. As soon as you stop, it gives the fish chance to get away. You're ever so shy. Oh, then you can do it. You can do it. Go on. Keep going, keep going. Biggest fish you ever caught. Keep going, keep going. You're doing really well. You're doing really well, Billy. Go on. <laughs> you're, you're tired out yet, no? It's hard work, Billy, isn't well, it? Nearly there. We'll see you fishing in a minute. Keep going, there he is. Is that, there he is. The Pass. Pass. Where is he? Pull off. Oh, it's, an, it's a beauty. <laughs> Go on, Billy. Yes, well Billy. Well done. Am I all right? Just... Second hus. Oh, nice. Right, Billy, can you do me a favour? Just hold that rod. Billy, look at me. <laughs> Come on, don't be shy. What do you think? Nice? Yeah. Well done. I'll tell you what, this pull hook looks very familiar. It does, doesn't it, John? There's a dark one. There's a dark horse. Oh, no. The fish point is brilliant. It's spitting lawns out, anyway. I've got a tea bath for it. Oh, right, I'll see you soon. Oh, is that the same one? Yeah, probably. Has he got the hook shirt at all? Can I hold it in a minute? Oh, you've got, you've got, you've got All hands on deck. Oh, that's a nice easy one there, that. Yes. Thank you, John. Oh, it's a double one. Right, Billy, you're going to hold this for a picture for me. Go on. Go on. See where his jaw is here. I think yours was darker than that, Leighton's was a bit darker, wasn't it? Yeah, it is heavy, what did you expect? Come here, right. come on, come on. Yeah, you need to face the camera, Billy. Grab it, grab it, don't be afraid of it. Right yeah, grab it, and then That's hold it. the tail. Get your hand on the still. It's not going to get you. It will. It won't get you. It won't get you. Right. Just keep taking it. Alfie, what are you saying, man? What do you reckon, Alfie? 
Mate. You reckon it's quite big? Right, pump and wind, lift the rod up. What it's all about. Well done, mate. Have you got one of those before? Rough ones, mate. Feel the skin. Just hold him there. Lift up and wind down. Doing really well. Yeah, I want to move move side side yeah. Lift. Bring your selfie out. Sorry, mate. Lift up. Right, call it. Oh, it's oh, oh, go on, go on. Oh, my, that's a beast. That's the biggest one of the day. The conga, yeah. There we go, it's a proper one. It's a proper one, this one. Well done. The younger one. Yeah. Well done, look at that. Oh my God. <laughs> right. What's that? 15. 15 pounder. Oh, it's still there, no, it's just coming towards you. Right, it's a keep. See how there's a bend in the road like that? There we go, there's another fish over the rail. Nice little conga. So we are, Kev, just doing up. Well, pretty much working your ass off, mate, aren't you? Can't be done. So what we're doing is we're just done, we're, we're, we're taking the rigs off and we're just putting ready baited rigs here, all ready for the kids' look, so they're not waiting at all. And we've had a real good night so far. Got a nice couple of nice husks. We've had a couple of nice eels, haven't we? Yeah. Yeah, keeping busy. Plenty of rod spending. How are you feeling, Billy? All right? Yeah. <laughs> Shy. Billy Green. How are you getting on, all right? Yeah. You getting bites out, mate? Yeah. Yeah, getting knocked, mate. Yeah. You on the bottom? Yeah. Sure. Just let a bit more line out. You want it? You'll get your more chance of an eel on the bottom or a hus. Go, Come on, Ross. Nice one, Ross. No, wrong. That's a nice husk. Very wrong. Oh, nice sandy one, mate. Beautiful, oh, beautiful. Look at that hook's just falling out. Oh. That's a nice little sandy one. Big one. A bit bigger. Oh, Great, right, Ross. Stills as well, mate. Oh, yeah. beast bone. Well done, mate. That's a slightly heavier one, isn't it? Do you want to turn my light off? Billy. Hands cold? Does anyone have... Nice one. <laughs> what is that? Nice husk. That is even bigger, isn't it? That's the best one so far. That's a proper husk. Come this way slightly. I would say you'd be close to the little go there, but it's double husk there. Yeah. Well done, buddy. Don't be mad. <laughs> what a beautiful macaron carp bait that's just fallen out of his mouth. Yeah. Oh my god, look at the size of this. That's well, that's well over 10. You just wet a like you say, you can lock your hand underneath its jaw. Look at 
This is a nice fish on here. Very nice. Just leave some slack off. Drop your rod up. Snagged up, you're not going nowhere. What do you say, John Congo has? Moment. Congo. Yeah. Nice fish, mate. Come on, Alfie. Come on, Alfie. Lift up. This could be a winner. Lift up. It's going to be bigger than you. Always keep it up, If it's a deal, it's going to be longer than him. Lift up. Here he comes. Come on. Go fish. Go on. Keep going, keep going. Don't stop, don't stop. After all of it now, we let go. Oh, yeah. Uh, Major fall. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the size of that! Who's well that? Mine. I don't think, it, I don't think it's the best one of the day, but that is a massive one. <laughs> Watch your face. Oh. Well done, Alfie. Well done, mate. You need a picture of that one, mate. Yep. It's all right, it's not going to get you, don't worry. We've got a lip grip. Look. How big's the hole in me there? <laughs> It's a monster! <laughs> well, uh, what size is it on a strong fish? Yeah, that's a nice fish. Look at the size of it. Yes! Good him! <laughs> oh. That's a proper one. That's a new. What's that way? Swings. Yes! Bye. Get in! It's very fat eel, isn't it? It's very short. It's got to be 25. <laughs> Get in! Yes, mate. <laughs> oh, I love it, man. Not buzz all in the world. You buzz in? Oh, I love it. Nice. Awesome. Well, the, well done, bud. Yellow grip. Mate. He's only had two beers as well, mate. It's the old speckled head. Oh, mate. That's, a, <laughs> that's oh, wow. look at the head on that, that's man. That's a beast. Yeah! Yes, mate. <laughs> so what's that way, you reckon? Well done. Let's have a look. My lip grip. It's a bloody sack of spuds, isn't it? Okay. Too many lights on here. 18. Is he off the floor? Yeah. yeah. 18 to 20. Oh, I'll give you 21 and a half. That's yeah. a lovely that. I'll buy that one. <laughs> <laughs> that big cool. Is we rolling? Yep. <laughs> right, so here we are. We've had a really good evening. Um, everybody's had fish. Apart from oh. one. <laughs> Sorry, mate. No, we've, all, we've had a really good night. Have you enjoyed yourself, kids? Yeah. yeah. Right. And what did you catch? A big... Conga, what did you get? Uh, a, oh, I don't know what it was. Pass? Pass. Uh, Another big pass, yeah? Yeah, so here we are, look. So we finished it. And um, Grant at Hook Points gave me these to give out to the kids, you know, because of all. Hook Point magazine is a really good magazine. There's hardly any adverts in it, no fillers or anything like that. So there you go, there's one for you. Right, there's one for you. And for you, and that's from Hook Point magazine. There you go. One for you, darling. Have a bit of light reading right. for you, like, later. So, should we get three cheers? Hip, hip. Hooray! Hip, hip. Hooray! Hip, hip. Hooray! 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 Well done. Nice. Let's go home. It's a wrap.